Hello everyone, back, um, greetings and salutations, it's Emmy from Emmy Made in Japan, back again with some more candy, 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 um, I got a question from somebody the other day asking me why candy, um, I'm not, I think a lot of you think I'm a candy freak, and I like candy, but um, I actually don't eat that much sugar. I know that's probably really surprising, um, but I really don't. I essentially try these candies because I'm curious about them, but I'm not a sugar fiend. I'm not, I'm not all that crazy about sugar. I'm just really more interested about what these things are. Um, and these candies I buy once, and I don't buy them again because um, my interest in these things are more about what they're about and how to make them more than um, so much as the candy like I'm a sugar fiend and I need to get my sugar in so just for those of you that are curious about um, my general well-being and my health I actually eat really well <laughs> I cook a lot and I don't eat that much sugar um, I think people have been concerned about my teeth um, and my general teeth health, um, I, I don't do anything more than brush my teeth a few times a day like everybody else does. I use a Sonicare toothbrush uh, that I bought at Costco, <laughs> for those that you want to know. I don't whiten my teeth, I just use my Sonicare toothbrush, brush in the morning and at night and I don't eat a lot of sugar. <laughs> I know that's really surprising, but... Okay, anyway, back with, um... <laughs> Poppin' Cookin'. Um, everyone saying, where's Poppin' Cookin'? Where's Poppin' Cookin'? So, Poppin' Cookin' Crepe. Um, and people have been correcting my pronunciation of crepe, or crepe. Uh, I think that's the English uh, pronunciation, crepe. Um, crepe is the French pronunciation. Um, some people say it sounds like crap. Um, to each their own. So I'm going to say crepe because that's how I want to say it and that's how I Another pop and cook in, this is the crepe cafe. Uh, incidentally, for those that haven't done much shopping in Japan, if you don't want a bag, you can say sono mama i desu, which just means I, that's fine and what they'll do is they'll put a piece of tape um, from the supermarket. Like this. And so yellow and pink powders and the cream powder bukuro chiburi bukuro some sprinkles a wafer and a very complex tray okay so the trays have been cut into one two and three and next we're going to cut the wafer into four pieces so first cut it in half cut each one of these in half so you've got four, then cut one of these into two, tri two triangles, and then cut this one in a little bit of geometry. Number one, low pattern, They're called mini puddings, large pudding, and this is the clip. So we'll just divide it between that. Here's. While we're waiting for the yellow stuff to congeal, we're going to do the same with the pink. And do the same thing, we're going to divide it between the waffle cone and the other two puddings. And the rest into the waffle. Same thing. Whoa. But it's definitely got a large volume. Alright, so carefully stir that one. This one's pretty full. Different consistency. It's more like um, icing. Reminds me of the icing from the um, the Happy Donuts. You can on the spoon and then jab it into the corner and now wipe it like that. Now, it's a good idea to cut this a little bit small. You can always cut the, the hole bigger if you need to. Slide it out. Get some cream first. Then we put our strawberry on the top. Take one of our little wafer sticks. 
put that in the top. Okay, next we're going to make the little wafer set, wafer down, a little zigzag pattern. Top with the other square. We have a little wafer sandwich, cakey. So I'm going to cut it in on the diagonal, a bit of cream, and pop that inside. Top it with the other waffle, just like that. We take the little pudding, pop him out, swirl. Triangle there, cream, pink topper, yep. Hey, there you have it. Pretty cute. Um, pink and yellow pudding, a waffle cakey, yep. and my waffle. So let's try it, um, shall we? Let's try crepe first. Um, looks like that. It's kind of jiggly with a little waffle thing on top. I'm not, I don't have high expectations. It's pop and cooking after all, right? But let's try it. Mm. <laughs> it's gross. It's totally gross. It's nothing like a real crepe. Um, it tastes like vanilla, but it's like vanilla jello. And um, these little waffle things, um, because these are wet, they get kind of soggy. So it's not very good. Um, I think basically they're all going to taste the same. Let's try the waffle one. Waffle thing. Mm. Same weird wet texture. I think of the two, the yellow one actually tastes better. It's got a vanilla pudding custard flavor. And the other one's supposed to be strawberry, but you don't really taste the strawberry. Um, I'm guessing this one's going to actually taste the best, the little cake. Oops, lost this top. Just because it's that frosting. Mm. It's pretty terrible, because unfortunately, um, this isn't crispy anymore. It's really soggy. Um... Okay, and I guess for the sake of everything, I should try one of these. Let's be civilized and use a spoon, shall we? Um, I'll try the the pink one. Let's just try it. It's going to taste like the others, right? <laughs> mm. It's gross. <laughs> totally gross. All of you out there who were waiting so patiently for this one, it's Pop and Cook and Crepe Cafe. Finally finished on um, what you're eating on Emmy Made in Japan. Thanks, you guys, for being patient. Thanks for watching. Thanks for subscribing and um, continuing to watch my videos. Um, yep, yeah. I'll see you again soon. Okay, take care. Bye.